not just the vlog, the weekend update. Woo! So today was a very, very long day. It started out very badly uh, with our file missing from our podcast. Fun. <laughs> I, it was very fun. It was very fun. We had to reshoot the Dancing with the Stars portion. Um, which is kind of a good thing because I looked up our microphone and I realized that we had it on the wrong setting. <laughs> so I got an education today as well. But it really set me back because I had to take my mom out and I got such a late start. I got home literally 20 minutes ago and it is a quarter to seven now. I'm exhausted, but I did buy a few things that I'd like to show you guys. Um, first of all, I got Sean this really cool Puma sweatshirt. It is literally so long that I could wear this as a, as a very short dress. <laughs> Maddie could wear it as a regular length dress. I could wear it as a very short dress. And uh, that's nice because it's hard to find Sean clothes that are long enough without actually buying big and tall man uh, clothes. And a lot of the times the big and tall men aren't that tall. So, um, oh hello. I'm just setting this up and that. <laughs> You're going to go out and have a nice dinner with your friends. Yeah. Uh, I went to TJ Maxx and Walmart. And this is what I have to show for myself. <laughs> I got some, uh, these are very necessary, I'm sorry, uh, heat retainers by Mucklux. I need these so badly because I always have cold feet. So these have like uh, an acrylic lining in them. Freaking love these. Live for these. Love them. I got a new pair of sweatpants, aka pajamas. <laughs> I was gonna buy, I was gonna wait for Black Friday and buy like a 10 tree pair of sweatpants, but hmm, $65 as compared to $16.99 at, at uh, TJ Maxx. I'm gonna go with the $16.99. So these are nice. They're cuffed on the bottom. They look super uh, comfy. They're pretty soft. Hopefully uh, they'll serve me well. Because I really do like sleeping in my sweatpants. I really, and I like going out in my sweatpants. A lot of the times I'll take Sean to the transport in my pajamas. And I don't like them to look like pajamas. I like them to look like sweatpants. So I'm only a little trashy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so yeah, I got one. I got another Denby. I call this the Dalmatian pattern. Uh, because it's kind of spotty. I really like it. Uh, so I've got two in each pattern now, and that makes me very happy. I love Denby. Baby puppy got a new leash. This is like for freaking monster dogs, which he is. Yes, you are. He came running over here. He was like, who, me? He just bit my finger so hard and had like a stifle of scream. Look at how yeah. thick that is. He can't bite through that. Definitely been biting a leaf lately. Excuse me, sir. I'm making a video. <laughs> Alright, can you take that in the other room, please? Go ahead, awkward puppy. <laughs> Alright. They need to go. They need to go. So at Walmart, I got some groceries. We got some mushrooms, some um, carrots. <laughs> I don't know what things are called anymore. I was going to make sweet and sour soy curls tonight, but it is almost 7 o'clock and I feel like poop. I just want to relax, so that's not happening. I got some of this Follow Your Heart American. This is one of my favorite cheeses, my favorite vegan cheeses. I'm really, really, really digging this Health Aid kombucha. I got it at um, Aldi yesterday on the cheap, and it wasn't as cheap at Walmart, but it was okay. And this pomegranate one is just as delicious as the grape one. I really, really like it. I got a nice loaf of Char um, gluten-free white bread. This looks way better than the Food for Life one. <laughs> Sorry, Food for Life, but Char is a little bit better. 
I got some uh, cheap ass sweet potatoes at Walmart. I think they were like 60 something cents a pound. So that's pretty awesome. Because when they're like 99 cents a pound at ShopRite, I'm like, woo! But like 60 something cents, awesome. Also super cheap, some green peppers at Walmart. Um, I have never seen this before. Um, they had it at Walmart. Dark, cho dark chocolate uh, chocolate chips. But the sweetener is stevia. It is uh, gluten-free and vegan. Awesome. I also got some gluten-free vegan um, chocolate chip cookies. Actually, it's free from the top eight allergens. So um, that's nice. Nut-free, too. And then I got some wow butter. Uh, since I can't have nuts and no peanuts either. So I'm going to give this a shot. See what if it's good or not. I think it's soy butter. They also had the um, the seed, you know, the seed butter. I can't remember what it's called. I don't know, but I can make that at home with my uh, pumpkin seeds and and sunflower seeds. I got some nice uh, vanilla for the baking season. The dogs got some sweet potato chews, dog treats, good stuff. They also got some best bully sticks. Uh, these are just uh, little bully stick bites. They really like uh, a small amount of bully stick. Excuse me, honey. And finally, I just got some uh, oat, yeah, oat milk creamer, which is Granny's absolute favorite. She's like, oh yes, daughter, get that one. That's the one that I like. So I got one for her too. And that is everything that I got today. All right, Flannel Man and I and Sean just got back from our shopping date. What? Not flannel. Um, sorry, it's just regular. You don't have any flannel anything on under there? <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> just kidding. Please. It's private. Alright, so we went to ShopRite and yes, we bribed Sean with some cheese doodles, which uh, Mark is eating right now. Sean, you like those cheese doodles? Why, did he have a meltdown? No, but you know what? He was a good boy. I saw him poking at a bag of lollipops and he didn't say anything about it. And then we got to the cash register point of sale and he he was looking at it and he picked it up and I said, okay, Sean, you can get that. But he was very good. He didn't make any uh, demands, so, but I did see him shopping. <laughs> Looking at stuff. Oh, look at that leg. Look at that kickback. Yay. Yeah, look at that kickback. Woo. Good girl. Good boy. Bowie smiles. Bowie smiles. He had the biggest smile today. And Minnie had a little goldfish smile. Oh. 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 <laughs> Hi, smiles. So let me just show you what we got because everyone's starving. It's almost seven o'clock. It's five to seven. So we didn't really get that much, but we did get this for free. We got our Guardian Holiday Roast for spending $400. <laughs> hey, here's $400. Hey, here's a, a holiday roast for you. Our ShopRite does uh, give away either a turkey a Stouffer's lasagna or the vegan option. Actually, there's two vegan options now, which is crazy, right? Oh my God. There's the holiday roast by Guardian and there's the tofurkey box with the brownie in it as well. So uh, we've always gotten the tofurkey roast box before. This time we decided to go with the Guardian. So there it is in all its glory. Delicious. Am I going to eat it? Probably not. I might have a slice, though, um, <laughs> because I was just talking with Mark about this. <sighs> the holidays are going to be difficult with the gluten. And since I have a gluten intolerance and not an allergy, I'm not really worried about going into shock from eating gluten. I'm just, it causes me stomach upset, so... If I want to have gluten during the holidays, I'm going to have to deal with an upset stomach. I'm not going to go hog wild on it, but um, like I'm not going to spend $5 to get the gluten-free pie crust when I can probably just um, 
use the regular pie crust for the pumpkin pie and one slice of it is not going to like do that much damage for me so I'm, I'm not going to like be crazy about it but day to day I'm going to avoid it as much as possible so the dogs got some chicken uh, they didn't really need it but I'm going to put it in the freezer because it was $1.77 a pound so I'm going to put that away for them they're going to use it this week but um, I couldn't pass up that price so we got some more lettuce we got another of the gluten free pizza crust mixes because this one was pretty good uh, I believe it's brown rice flour et al other stuff <laughs> some uh, peas and beans this was marked down for everyone else to enjoy <laughs> roasted garlic ciabatta it's one of Maggie's favorites uh, some vegan mayo Maddie's got her D&D &D group tomorrow, and she's making blueberry muffins. So we found some beautiful, fat, juicy blueberries for her to put in the muffins. So there you go. And we got some uh, vegan butter, some french fries, because tonight we're having hamburgers, and these just happen to be gluten-free. We got some uh, Gardein on sale, so we got some Chipotle lime, some chicken scallopini, always gluten-free, and I believe this is also gluten-free, so we can still have, um, oh my god, what's the one, Dan Dan noodles with uh, rice noodles, so nice. Also some tomatoes, we were completely out of hummus, so we have two beautiful tribe hummuses, or hummusai lemon rosemary and roasted garlic marks cold cuts some beautiful um wasabi peas fun fact these are not green <laughs> because the ones that are green use food coloring and the ones that don't have the food coloring i was surprised to find out that they're cheaper than the ones that use the food coloring that's crazy right you think it would be the other way around some cream of tartar that's a uh, gluten-free baking staple and I found these beautiful char gluten-free cocoa wafers these are like those cheap ass crackers that I loved as a kid my parents would get them around the holidays all the time and a lot of time <laughs> and they had always had nuts or milk or whatever in and I found these gluten-free and vegan what a find and on and half price dollar ninety nine some seaweed snacks yes I got the uh, cereal with the d3 in it but uh, I have to go with what my wallet will allow <laughs> it was on sale and I uh, I hate the fact that I couldn't pass it up I hate it but it's gluten free and the gluten free cereals I don't know if you've been down the gluten free aisle they're quite expensive so I decided to um, to get the checks sorry and um, some kefir for the dogs and that is all that we got today on this shopping trip one more thing <laughs> I found the cauliflower for four dollars that was bigger than Mark's head yeah <laughs> so if Mark's head were to fall off this is what it would be like carrying it around in a bag boy this is heavy this harkens back to when we went to go see Veggie Tales in uh, Pennsylvania and we stopped at the Green Dragon Flea Market and got a giant ass cauliflower for like I can't even remember how much it was back then do you remember was it like 275 or something like that it was not free nothing is free so this is like the size of I want to say like three regular cauliflowers for four dollars so that was pretty freaking amazing and they had a whole like bunch of them this must have been like um, a really good year for cauliflower because usually they're not that great yeah dogs waiting around although they already ate yeah, and they also have pizza. Yeah, so it's a beautiful Denby night. Just kidding. It's a. <laughs> I'm telling you, those plates. It's burger night. Play games with your eyes. Yeah, I love it. I don't like it. It has this like um, 
warp speed thing going on. I was just going to say that. Yeah. I really like it. This is the one that I call Dalmatian, but I'm sure that's not the real name of it. I don't know if it has a name. I mean, it probably does, right? Doesn't everything? I'm sure. But I call it Dalmatian. This is what they have in the stores now. The They don't have the cobalt blue one anymore. Mm -hmm. What will they come up with next? I don't know, but I'll be there to see it. I hope. <laughs> so we're having these, um, I call them the Beyond Knockoff Burgers. But I believe the people who make these burgers are, um, who did I say they were last time? Dang it. I don't know. Now I can't, Light Life. Is this the Light Life burgers? I think, uh, I, I might be totally wrong. I don't know. They're a little bit on the salty side, but. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. We're also having these delicious uh, matchstick fries. Oh, they're so good. Mmm. They're really good. Enjoy, devil. Mmm, <laughs> you made a nice burger for yourself there. With the, um, with the knockoff chow cheese there. Yep. Love it. Enjoy. treat myself a little. Yeah, you should. You deserve it. No one's ever gonna treat you good, as good as you treat yourself. Okay. <laughs> well, at least I look. It's a working girl. <laughs> My mom just oh, gave me a cookie. Oh, ow, ow. So yes, you've guessed it. It's Monday morning. Sorry. I didn't even wash my face yet. <laughs> this one's headed off to uh, play games on a movie. Yeah. <laughs> Pretend to be somebody who she's not. That's right. Hope, it, hope you have fun. I hope so too. <laughs> they said you would have fun today, so. It's supposedly going to be a fun day. I don't know what that means. But... <laughs> Look at this one. What are you doing? I'm being a kook. Are you helping me tie my shoes? I tried to get it on camera all weekend. This is his new favorite thing to do. Get up on this ottoman completely, all four feet, and stare at the TV. Yeah. <laughs> what a weirdo. He said, I want to be part of the family business. <laughs> I want to watch myself on TV. Aww. Will you go up there now? Nope. If we put... A video of him on the TV. Maybe. Will he know? Yeah, maybe. He tried to climb up on this table this weekend, and I was like, uh-uh. Uh, sir, please. No. We need you to get down. Yeah. Please do not do that. You will slip off. <laughs> and that table will come crashing down to the ground. Yeah, we don't need that. Alright, she's already late. No, I'm not. Oh, I thought you were leaving at 7. Yeah, but that was a buffer. I'm actually early. Oh, okay. Okay, that's good. She's got a long drive. Um, so that's the weekend update, kids. Uh, hope I didn't leave anything out. If I did, I apologize. If I did, and I find it out in editing, I'll put it right here. But if not, have a great week. This is the start of a new week. And uh, hopefully it'll be a good one. <laughs> I can't believe... We're so close to the holiday season. It's, it's coming quick, and I am not prepared for it whatsoever. So, yeah. But I want to thank you all for watching. You're awesome. We appreciate you. And until next time, much love.